Hey everybody! Sorry it's been so long since I've done this, but, you know, stuff's been going on, the usual excuses. Um, I just want to talk about a couple things. Firstly, I don't know if I've kind of made this generally known, but, um, I was having some thoughts about whether I should tell my parents about what I'm doing on YouTube, and I decided to tell my dad a couple weeks ago. And at first he was pretty upset, just because, you know, I've been hiding this stuff from him. Um, but, you know, he listened to me and listened to my explanation and my reasons. Um, and I told him if he wanted to, he could check out my videos and make sure I wasn't doing anything sketchy. Um, and after that, he seemed he seemed a little more okay with it. Um, and I don't think he's told my mom, which on the whole I think was a good decision. Because my mom and I don't get along and she's less understanding than he is. So... Um, he also said he didn't really want to look at my videos, just, which I think is a good idea too, because, you know, here I'm being completely honest, and, you know, he could find out some things about me that he may not want to know, you know, because even your parents don't need to know everything about you. Anyways, um, second thing, I went to Vegas, which was awesome for my birthday, um, a couple weeks ago, I guess. It's been, yeah, almost, yeah, it's been almost a month now since I went. Um, it was cool. Coincidentally, I was on the 16th floor of our hotel in the 16th room from the end of the hall, which my friend and I thought was pretty cool since it was my 16th birthday. And that was completely on plan. So, um, the rooms were really cool, and um, we had this great view of Vegas and the pool. The pool was really cool, but incredibly crowded. And we spent most of our time in there. But we walked around. We went through the Venetian. You know, we went through Venice, which I thought was kind of cute. It reminded me a lot of Disneyland. And um, and then we went to the Bellagio. We didn't manage to see the the water show, even though we wanted to. We tried a couple times, but we kept missing it. But we did get to get gelato, which is pretty awesome. So it was really good. I totally forgot to mention that I saw Sector Soleil, which is like the whole reason that we went to Vegas for my birthday. It was amazing, like jaw dropping. I was like stunned the whole time just watching what they were doing. It was so cool. And it was like stupefying what they were doing. I think my favorite act, I saw Mystere, um, which is kind of the classic one. Doesn't have quite as much of a theme, but um, I, my favorite act was probably the Strongman, because that was just insane. Because they were like totally hot. But, um, as my friend said, they're probably gay, so that kind of ruined it. I had a great time, and my friend and I, you know, she's my best friend, so we get along, like, crazy. It's just so much fun with her, so that was awesome. And last thing, I started school today, so I'm taking three classes at college. I think I mentioned this before. I'm taking English Lit, Spanish 2, and hoping to get into beginning piano, but if I can't, I'm going to take digital photography, um, which is really cool. And so far, I've been into two of my classes, and the professors seem really cool, and it seems like it's going to be a good year. All I have to do at home is math, um, and it's really easy. So, you know, I'm probably, yeah, I'm going to have to work a lot as far as homework and studying, but it's going to be, I think, a lot lighter than it was last year and a little bit more enjoyable. So, yeah, I'm, I'm really excited about that. My mom and I haven't been getting along very well recently, so, yeah. I have my driver's license now, but I am not allowed to drive by myself yet, which I'm not very happy about, as you could imagine. And it's nothing that I did, it's just my parents. Um, first I thought I was being punished, and then my mom said I wasn't being punished, she just wasn't ready for me to drive by myself. 
even though she says I'm a good driver and I'm very mature. So I'm pretty frustrated. But hopefully this will blow over in a couple weeks. She'll probably get tired of having to drive me to college. It stinks for me, but it stinks just as much for her. So, you know, what can I say? And uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. Oh, I am going to drive to soccer practice tonight, which is cool. So I'm going to wrap this up, and I don't have anything particular to say. So, goodbye, chill out. Hope you guys are squeezing the last bit of enjoyment out of your summers if you haven't started school already. Um, and thanks for all your messages. I love you guys, and hopefully I will have another video out for you soon. So, just because I have a random question to ask you guys, I'm going to make an official random question of the day, or ROD. So, where's the I come from? You know, iPod, iTunes, iPhone, iPhoto, iMovie, iSight, I, 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 I mean, where does it come from? Does it stand for something? I mean, you've got the Apple, Mac, I. It doesn't make any sense. Unless it's supposed to mean I as in me. Like, I is the most important thing. But that's not grammatically correct. And it should be like, the, the me pod. The me phone. Well my, my phone. I?